It is a long-standing tradition in the city of trees, attracting visitors from around the country. It's pretty cool. It's called Freak Alley yeah. in downtown Boise, which is the largest mural gallery in the Northwest. And this week, it is getting a makeover. Mm -hmm. On your side's Karen Lair joins us in studio with the details. Roland Michelle, every year since the gallery opened in 2002, Freak Alley founder Colby Aker selects artists to give the alley a facelift. Some murals stay while others are replaced, and tonight the artists are putting the final touches on their work ahead of this weekend's exhibition. These are the many faces of Freak Alley. Slight sense of the ominous, slight sense of the mysterious. Covering the walls between buildings and the heart of downtown Boise. It's a really nice way to get people who don't normally see art to engage in art because all you got to do is be downtown, walk through the alley and you get to see all sorts of amazing stuff. The artists responsible working by headlights, letting their creative juices flow into the early morning hours. It's like power hour. I try to go until at least like two or three usually. That's kind of when a lot of the creative things begin going around. You don't really get that much chance to like take your time on a wall like this. So whenever you get one, you got to take advantage of it. Every year, artists submit work to be considered as select spaces in the alley undergo a week long makeover. Some artists carry a certain inspiration and a specific message behind every stroke. This year I want to do a theme of like addiction and just kind of like the toxic nature of humans, you know, and so we're kind of self-destructive. While many other artists like Freak Alley first timer Ray Carraway leave their murals left for interpretation to each individual admirer. It depends on the moment of thought too, you know, it could say this now or say this later. One person will go, oh, it's, uh, you know, it's the, these heads on an island and it's this. Another person will go, no, it's a group of saints gathering for something. Over the years, the alley has attracted regular visitors, becoming a backdrop for more than just parked cars and dumpsters. The people that do wedding shoots, uh, senior photos, uh, car photos, models that come through. Artists chosen to be a part of Freak Alley range in age, background, style, and experience level, but once they get brushed to brick, many share a common thought. Don't mess up. You never stop learning, so it doesn't matter how long you've been doing it, you can learn from the guy that's just starting out too. Most artists work on their own and spaces are assigned, but organizers say so far that's never been a problem. We'll get a collection of themed work that meshes really well together and nobody knows. Colby just eyeballs you a spot. You just kind of have to adapt to your space. This space had a black and white piece before and Colby wanted something that was just two-tone and one of my ideas really fit that so we said okay well that worked perfectly. While the fresh paint is still drying, even the most frequent visitors would agree there's always something new to discover. So you can still catch the artists in action tonight and check out the finished products at tomorrow's exhibition show, which starts at 5 p.m. Roland Michelle. <laughs> okay, I have a question. Okay. Did you have a favorite? Are you allowed to even say that? I actually, the artist that was the returning artist, the black and white, the really yes. big mm -hmm. one, he had my favorite one last year and he got to do the same spot on the wall that he did last year and he just kind of switched it up a little bit. So I told oh. him, I said, I came and I saw you working last year and I saw you back in the same spot this year and he's awesome. Yeah, really it's awesome. really cool. It's so neat that the city of Boise takes something that's normally ugly like an alleyway and turns it into something beautiful. How many artists really are out there working? Um, more than 60 wow. this year wow. working on um, spaces down there, some of them for the first time and some of them that have been doing it for years. That's Great so artwork. neat. Thanks, Thanks for Karen. The story, Karen.